Hi, my name is Neve Field. I'm an Animal Health Research Officer in Moor Park. I'm just recording this short video to talk about clostridial diseases of cattle. So we're coming into April now and young cattle are heading out to pasture. Um, clostridial diseases are caused by bacteria that are usually found in the soil and they form spores in the soil that cattle eat. Um, these spores then settle out in muscle tissue and various organs throughout the body and lie dormant for quite some time. Um, the most common form of clostridial disease we see in Ireland is blackleg and in this disease it usually affects young growing cattle between six months old and two years old. So what happens is the spores that they've ingested are in their muscles lying dormant um, and some unlucky animals then if they get a kick or some other form of trauma in just the wrong spot where the spores are there is a chance that they will activate um, and begin to germinate and release huge amounts of toxin into the area. Um, this is usually fatal for the animal and in most cases with blackleg you find the animal dead in the field. Um, if they're still alive they'll have a high fever, um, they'll be severely lame on the affected leg um, and they'll be in a lot of pain. So you must call your vet if you find an animal like this obviously and they will probably prescribe um, some penicillin antibiotics um, but in a lot of cases the animal usually dies. Um, so definitely prevention is better than cure in this case um, and there's numerous um, vaccinations that protect against clostridial bacteria on the market. Um, some will protect solely against the one that causes blackleg, others um, will, will protect against numerous strains of the bacteria um, and the best uh, way to decide what's best for your farm is to discuss with your vet um, and they will usually take into account the history of your farm. So particularly if you've had cases of blackleg on your farm in the past, it would be a good idea for you to be vaccinating your young stock prior to turnout to protect them from this disease. Um, older cattle in general are less likely to get it, probably because they build up some form of immunity over time to this bacteria as they ingest it off the soil. Um, so yeah, now is a good time to be thinking about clostridial vaccines. Thank you.